Hi, and welcome back to my channel. It's definitely been a bit, but that's okay. We're good. My new apartment, yes, I'm still in Vancouver, unfortunately. But my new apartment does have great natural lighting, so this is lovely. Um, and yeah, I recently went thrifting, and over the past few months, bought a bunch of things and just thought I would share it with you guys because I love watching thrift hauls, I love thrifting. So yeah, let me show you some of the things I got. And some of the stuff is in Valley Village, others is from like uh, curated thrift stores that have like picked out pieces and they're like vintage shops. Um, so those are a little bit more expensive, but first I'll start with some Value Village pieces. So one of the most exciting things, I'm gonna start with a bang here, is this jacket I thrifted. And I got this, it's like this plaid oversized jacket. It kind of reminds me of like, I don't know, like something that um, you would find at like Aritzia or something like Hailey Bieber would wear. It's super oversized. Uh, plaid like I mentioned and it was in the men's section I have no idea the size but it actually says it's um, the brand Burton Taylor no idea what that means but it's by appointed to Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II Taylor I don't really know what that means when something's like by appointed by the Queen but I think it means that she like likes the brand or something anyways so the quality is really good it says made in England you know um, finest seal skin finish not really sure what that means but I just love the overall look of it I love how it's oversized you know wool coats are expensive like if you go to Revolve you go to Ritzy's websites wool coats are like literally 300 minimum dollars for a wool coat and yeah, I'm really happy with this the fit is a little bit boxy it's a little bit more masculine but I personally like that fit so I'm really excited I purchased this and this was only $30, so that's a pretty good deal. And it's warm, and it's great. I wear it in the rain in Vancouver, and I stay dry, so I love it. I also thrifted this really pretty white linen button-up. I just wanted a plain linen button-up just to like wear. Um, I work at Microsoft now, and I am not going in office right now, but the office is open if I ever wanted to go in, so I was thinking of maybe going in. So it would be nice to have some more like casual clothes. And I think this button up would be great with like jeans or dress pants or whatever. And I think the material is like, what's the material? Linen? It's an everyday slim fit uh, shirt. It's actually by Old Navy, but again, the quality is like super thick. Uh, I think it's 197% cotton actually, but I just love how the weight of it, it really sits really nicely on me. And um, yeah, I just wanted like a plain button up and it was literally like $5. So it's like the best thing to get thrifted. Next up is this really cute black tank top. Um, these are great if you ever go thrifting and you just want like basic little tank tops to wear. This is really great just to like layer under blazers um, or in the summertime, like it's just such a staple. Like you can't go wrong with something like this. Like it's literally like $2 and you can layer it so much and it's just part of like, and it's just something you can wear. And it's just gonna be a staple in your wardrobe. It's made in China, doesn't say the material, but it's just like a knit tank top. Like literally right it has these for like $50. So the fact that I can thrift one is just great for my wardrobe. Next is a hat. I've always wanted this hat um, and I saw it at the thrift store and I got it because I just thought it was super cute like to wear with like hoodies and like you know like when you are like a little bit of like um, you know when you just want to be a little more like undercover and when it like rains and stuff which is literally every day in Vancouver and you want to wear a hat. Um, yeah I think it's cute in the summer like it's like a baseball cap um, or just like, you know, casual. I just really like the look of that. So yeah, that. The next thing I'm really excited about was because this is like genuinely really expensive, I think. Uh, not really expensive, but pretty expensive. And it is a TNA, no, it is a Babaton size small um, of their sculpt bodysuits. And these were like literally, you couldn't even get them off the Aritzia website. Like I'm pretty sure um, Aritzia didn't have these available until like literally the new year, until they recently restocked. But I'm so happy I got it at the thrift store. It did feel brand new and the tags from Aritzia like were still on it. I think it was like $13.99. But um, some people would probably be sketched out like buying a bodysuit from the thrift store just because like it's literally like a thong. But it felt so new and like literally the quality was amazing that it did make me feel like it was like used and abused of a situation so I felt comfortable buying with it and if it was gonna save me literally like 50 75 dollars like 
it's amazing i love this square neckline like this is something you're gonna have in your wardrobe all the time and i got it from value village so like that is such a good deal this piece is just this white long sleeve by the brand gilladin i'm pretty sure this is like walmart's brand but literally just like a cropped white long sleeve i have this same thing in black from tna and i spent like i think i got it on sale for 20 dollars, but you can get this from like aritzia for pretty expensive and it's just like literally a cotton shirt that um is cropped and yeah i really like it i wear it working out or i wear it like um just every day like with jeans and it was literally like five bucks and it's just a perfect staple for your wardrobe next up is this sweater and this is from uniqlo and it's 100 percent wool and i got it for 9.99 and it's just this wool uh sweater and yeah it's a really good basic for um the fall it's a great layering piece it's 100 percent wool and it's super warm it hasn't pilled at all size large and yeah it's just such a good piece i love the color like this oatmeal color and it's just so soft on my skin the what i like about it is the turtleneck doesn't feel like it's choking me sometimes turtlenecks and i have like thyroid problems maybe this is why but i literally feel like i'm choking to death in a turtleneck whereas this feels like it's sitting not against my skin so it's really nice to feel like i can actually breathe so i really like this I picked up a few a crew neck and a hoodie. This crew neck I got with my friends at a vintage shop and my one friend was like, you need to get this, it's so cute. And I haven't really worn it a lot because when I do wear it, people yell at me. And it's this Florida Gators like vintage crew neck. And you know like how you see these on like some websites and they literally go for like $50. So like I like the look of it with like, you know, like jean shorts or something in the summer. Um, but I don't know. It's a little bold for me and i don't like being yelled at like i literally walk wore it twice and i walked the seawall and like random guys were like let's go gators and i was like oh my god like i'm canadian i don't even know what that means like what i think it's a football team but it feels makes me feel a little uncomfortable like being yelled at but the look of it's really cool and if you want that like vintage look like this with like a bunch of layered jewelry it is really cute it's just i don't know i have to be cautious when i wear it and then i got this blue hoodie and i just love the color honestly like i think if i got like a matching like biker short that was this color it'd be a perfect set and i, I don't know why for some reason i just love the color i think it got in like the kids section to be honest like i think this is literally for the loom or russell athletic whatever that means but it's just like your basic like blue hoodie that you can get like anywhere but i just thought the color was super bright and fun and yeah i thought i could wear it in the summertime more with like um athleisure clothes going to the gym with white sneakers just a great hoodie i love getting hoodies and crewnecks from the thrift store it's always so cheap and last but certainly not least i got this sleeping set so i guess it's like oh it's from victoria's secret so i guess it's like lingerie pretty much but it's something i would sleep in and it's just this really cute and i think it's like has the old victoria's secret logo if i am correct so maybe it's like a vintage victoria's secret but yeah it's just really cute the square neckline and it's like obviously see-through and it's like in great condition and yeah i just thought it would be nice to like sleep in and it was like 20 dollars, and i just think it's the most feminine cutest thing that's all i got um thrifting so far really excited to add these pieces to my wardrobe into the fall and winter months and i'm going to continue thrifting because it's honestly just so much fun like i get a lot of joy of just like kind of walking down the aisles and exploring new pieces and stuff so yeah let me know if you guys like these videos and i'll continue to make them and yeah thank you so much for watching my channel and i'll see you in the next video